It wow, it was a 97 Pele. Oh my god, guys. Oh, there is a 93 Frankie. I did not expect that. So we got a Pele. We got a Stoikov 94. We got two different versions of a Billy. Let's go uh let's go actually look at the these uh these players. Let's go look at these players. I mean, the 97 Pele, I don't know who the hell is going to pack that, but he looks crazy. Um, concepts. Where is it? I really want to go. Can I go look at Evos real quick first? I need to see what they've done if we if we have new Evos to, to grind. Golden Glow Up, Legends of the Pitch, Jack of All Trades, Secret Stuff. Here we go. Skilled Wing Defense. Overall, 86. Pace, 90. Must not be right back. One playstyle plus. Defending Max 85. Well, lucky enough for me, I can use Sam Byram in this. Wait, does my Sam Byram already have five star skills? Oh, it's a plus four. Oh, wow. 100k for that. Damn, what? Damn, Sakamoto becomes a five star, four star. That's kind of juiced. Holy, that's a randomly good card. What about Wilms for the Dutch team? She will be five star, three star. Okay, Wilms looks pretty good. So, and not that I would have given it to him. Oh, there you go. Rico Lewis can be used. Not that I would have given it to him, but uh, my, what, 80 rated Jed Spence can't be used in this? I wonder, I wonder why. Let me have a look here. Again, I find at this point in the game the limitations on these SBCs a bit silly. So, he's not a right back. Crazy. The only thing keeping him out is actually his position and play style. That's kind of nuts. Wow, one too much pace. One too much pace. That's painful. But I wouldn't have given it to him anyways. We'll give it to we'll give it to Sam Byram. That's crazy that I can't use Ailing. Giving Bill five star skills would be hilarious. But they both can play center back, so it takes them out of uh, the running. Okay, so we'll, uh, we'll probably spend it on Sam Byram. The hell is this? Is this new? Two foot attack. Only six days though. Wait, max overall 86. 77 shooting minimum, but max 90. Okay. That is pain. Oh my god. Again, the playstyle's hurting Patrick Bamford. We could give it to Piro, though. I think he already... Annoyingly, he already has a 5-star weak foot, which sucks. We've already given him a five-star weak foot. But. Wow. Uh, I think I might have to give this to Joel Piro. Holy. Yeah, Bamford would have been crazy. Oh my god, this Bamford card would have been crazy.
super unfortunate. Oh, that's the only cards in my club that I could even uh, give it to. Huh. Interesting. Well, it's going to be... Wait, does CR7 actually fit, guys? Oh, that's fun. I like that. I mean, I already have a Winter Wild card, Cristiano, but that's cool then. I like that, that you can uh, you can give it to, to Cristiano, finally. 79 pace. Yeah, but that's okay. I mean, 86 Ronaldo is still kind of effective, actually. Five star, five star for Ziyech is kind of kind of rad. I know he plays for Galatasaray, so probably won't be using uh, or upgrading this card. But in terms of upgrades, it's kind of sick. There you go. For all the Greeks out there. Oh my God! <laughs> Two star skills. <laughs> Holy shit. What the hell is this card, though? Crazy. Awful card, but awesome card all at the same time. Oh, man. Again, I wish instead of having it a number of playstyles max one, have it where one of your two playstyles has to be replaced by the next playstyle. You get me? So at the end of this grind, I have to choose between his first touch or his rapid being replaced by the power shot. So I'd probably get rid of the first touch and give him the power shot. Know what I'm saying? Th that, that, sh that should be what it is at this point in the game. Okay, so I'm going to give it to Puro, but I don't know who I'm going to give the second one to. Sweet. Well, I'm happy about Evos. It's just way more Evos to do. Gonna have to work through uh, who we give them to. Now let's go see what the new team looks like and then let's yeet packs and check the SBCs and all that goodness. So. I, did I skip past the fun birthdays? In progress, but where's the actual fun birthdays? Ah, here we go. I mean, that has to be the best card in the history of the game. With an engine? Dear God. He's got the tech playstyle plus, too. Unreal. Um, look at those stats. Five star, five star? High, high work rates? Did they just randomly make the best box to box mid in the game for fun? Bro, you give this card an anchor. Who needs a, a birthday hullet? Okay, that Pirlo is crazy. What about the ability cards? Oh yeah, you know they're going to make the ability cards crazy good too. Holy sh... She's got a tech playstyle as well. So same card, just one is weak foot, one is skills, yeah? Yeah. Damn, I guess you get to pick and choose. Do you want a box-to-box -box mid or do you want a... Um, again, this card with an engine as your box-to-box -box mid? There's so many crazy good cards now. I'd love to have this Stoikov 5-star, five 5-star five instead of the one I have. I mean, that's also just a nutty-ass card. Uh, Raul? Damn! What the heck? With tech as well. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Oh, fought birthday Zanetti. Was this, is this old? It looks like his Centurion card. Just with a little bit better stats. He's got whip pass as well. That Zanetti looks crazy. Butra got added. Oh, there's one for Nepo. Five-star, four-star Ian Wright with rapid and power shot. Dear goodness gracious. Again, with an engine. What a nutty card. Does he have two different cards? Oh, Zanetti has two different cards. 
Right. I suppose he'd want to go with a five star weak foot, right? At right back? The dark. Nesta is new five star weak foot? Or is that from last week? I don't know. Oh, okay, no. So they we got two Ian Wrights. You just pick. I would use this one at striker, the other one I would use out wide. Shiny, I can't remember if that's new or old. Looks insane. I think that Shiny might be old. A new Keen? Good God. Yeah, this Keen with the shadows. Oh my. The slide tackles again. I like this though. Bruiser and slide tackle plus for someone like Keen is kind of hilarious. I do like that. Very fitting. Oh! With skills is kind of stupid. It's funny because, honestly, I would have given the dynamic image with a five-star weak foot to this one. Is Keen old? Oh, okay. Anyways, I didn't. I must not have noticed him. Perez? Perez. Team of the Year Perez last year was good. Again, I don't know if this was last week or this week. Don't really care, honestly. I'm not overly interested in Perez anyways. Okay, and then let's go see the actual players. So you got the two versions of Salah and Mane. Liverpool fans erupting with that, I guess. Two versions of Mane, too. Oh, my game froze, guys. Oh, we're back. I don't know. Dude, five-star, four-star for Mo Salah seems cool as hell. Out wide, definitely going with the five-star skills. Maybe if you're running a two-man striker setup and you get lucky enough, you go with this five-star, four-star Salah at striker, left striker. Power shot and rapid is kind of nuts. I'd always go five-star skills for Mane too, for his pace and his size and stuff. It's like they've done tech or power shot for every single player, it seems like, in the attacks. Frankie is, honestly, guys... I think I want this card more than I want Rude Hullet. Oh my lord. This is the one I would go with right here. Four star, five star, high, high work rates with those stats. Oh my god. I'd give him a Hawk as well. It's got Tiki Taka too, Finesse, Incisive Pass, Anticipate, Travella, Press Proven. That's a, that's an erupt card. That is an erupt card. I'm sure that Frankie will be. Is there only one version of Frankie as well? Yep. Four star, five star Foden. So we got a Foden. I mean, I guess all the upgrades are kind of pretty, pretty generic, right? Oh, look at that Mudrick with the uh, Ronaldo noodle hair. That's a dope dynamic image, man. Again, if I'm using him out wide, I'd probably go with the skills. Five star, four star. With a dead eye. Rapid and Travella too. That's cracked, man. We got a new Marco Royce. Oh! We got a many, boys! Oh, God. Took them long enough to give many a proper... Oh, my days. <laughs> wow. Wow. Is this from last week? Please don't tell me this was last week and I never realized that many was um was in the was in the team. Was this from last week? Damn, what a card. That's a nice card. Mead, of course, was last week, right? Jota. <gasps> we got a new Jonathan David. Oh good god. Well, that now is the Canadian R9. What the hell? He's got first touch and Travella too. That's kind of interesting. Quick step, finesse and chip shot. This is the this is the Canadian. This is actually the Canadian R9. Okay. Well, we need to figure out how we're going to pack that uh, Jonathan David. 5 star 5 star such an eruption, dude. I've been sitting on my uh RTTF Jonathan David for ages. Gioro got one too? Ah, eh, no different than her Centurion card, really. Her Centurion card is crazy good. I don't know if Swanson is old. Mappy Leon looks crazy good. Left-footed. 
Five star weak foot. Three five two left center back. Erupt. Erupt with an anchor card. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's a nice. That's a very very nice card. Okay, so Gyoro got both. I feel like I'd still go with the five star weak foot though. Okbene is old, right? Grimaldo's old. Puli's old. Jordi Alba, I think, is new. Danjuma getting another one. We got two Canadians! We got a Taijan freaking Buchanan as well! Wait. Can any of these guys fit into the new Evos? No, he's got way too much pace, right? Oh, that is just such an erupt. You could use him at right back as well, actually. Four, five star, three star. Wow, I got all the things I wanted. No Leeds players, but a couple of Canadians? I was wondering if maybe there's two Taijons. Nope. Maitland Niles getting one? That Maitland Niles looks good, unless that was last week, but that does look good. Looks like a nice card. Four star, five star, and then his other one is obviously the opposite of that. Kynes might be a new one, too. He'll be in everybody's packs. Oh, I'm kind of glad we built up a god-tier amount of packs, boys. So many Canadians. Let's freaking go. We're actually going to get an improvement on our Canadian national team. It's been months. Uh, so, Evo's squad. I guess I'll have a quick look at objectives here. Oh. Oh. Doesn't look like new objectives. Okay. Can I eat packs now? Wait, no. I didn't go to SBCs yet. Hold on. What's in the SBCs? We get a refresh of the icon PP. We'll do that today. Oh. Many's an SBC. 10 squads is insane, though. Dare I say this will be worth it. Oh, my God. 290s and 289s. Are they on drugs? The Savarnier is an SBC player. Yeah, I'm not even going to... Or Sorry, an objective player. I don't even care about that card. Very, very overpriced, guys. I I, I, I would um, I would definitely argue that that's very overpriced. Best center back in the game? I hate that this card has been available for three, four months, but I, I, I'm not joking when I say this. I know you guys would expect me to say my right-footed attacker out wide, the best one in my club is David Ginola. It's not. It's not. The best right-footed attacking-minded player out wide for my club and how I play the game is my base Ribery. This is genuinely one of the first cards I'm highly considering completing. In a long time. God, I know he's going to be stupid expensive, though. I mean, I'm, I'm highly annoyed that he's so expensive, but I'm not kidding, man. He's so fucking good. He's so good, man. He also has Travella, bro. Rocket, Travella. I... This card with a Maestro is going to be scary. Wide left and wide right. Scary. I'm very tempted to craft this. I just yeeted my whole club, though, into uh, upgrades. I'll think about this. I'm going to favorite it for now. I'm going to think about that.